Around 15 million people are expected to descend on the city of Paris as the Olympics and Paralympics come to town. That means a lot of police are going to be needed, and now France is asking for some outside help. It's asked 46 countries if they are willing to volunteer 2,000 police officers and even some military help for the Paris Games that kick off in July. Still, the bulk of police, security forces, and service members will be supplied by France. International conflicts like the wars in Gaza and Ukraine have raised safety concerns. And the recent attack at a concert hall in Moscow that left more than 140 people dead prompted France to increase its security alert to the highest level. The French prime minister says authorities are taking into account the Islamic State's claim of responsibility for the attack and the threats weighing on our country. Security is an enormous challenge for any host country, but France is especially wary after experiencing repeated terrorist attacks in the past. One military official says there is extreme vigilance surrounding security at the games. The needs are specific, like sniffer dog teams, mine clearance specialists, anti-drone specialists, even document fraud experts. So far, 35 countries have responded to the request. Poland is sending troops, including sniffer dog handlers, and Britain and Italy are reportedly sending dozens of police. And despite war, the Israeli military will send their own security capacities and the U.S. will send their own as well. It's not uncommon for international sporting events to have foreign police, but military personnel are less common. Right now, the biggest security concern is for the opening ceremony taking place on the 26th of July.